what's going on guys, Toxico Serial. Welcome back to another Brawl Stars video. Today we're going to be doing one of my more requested videos and we're going to be ranking all of the Supercell Make skins. There are 13 of them, however, there's only 12 in the game right now. The one that's not in the game is Mecha Colt. I'll pull an image of it right here because just so you know, it was a Supercell Make skin, just not in the game yet. So I won't be ranking this one, but if I had to rank it, it's definitely top three, no question. But... Obviously, it's not in the game yet, so I can't rank it because obviously Supercell likes to kind of change the name. I don't think they're going to change the name, but they'll change like some detail about it. So I'm, that's why I'm not ranking it because it's too early to rank a skin that Supercell hasn't implemented into the game yet. So yeah, but there are 12 that we're going to be ranking and we're going to start all the way with 12, go to way to one. And before I start ranking them, I just want to say these are all amazing skins and this was really hard to rank them, but... I have to rank them 12 to 1, so if you're not happy, I'm sorry. All of them are very, very good. All of them are A tier. Majority are S tier. There's a few that are not S tier that are still A tier. But, like I said, this was a very challenging, very, 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 very challenging because there's just, they're all so good. So, let's get into the video. Coming in at the worst Supercell make skin, I'm sorry, it's Gladiator Colette. Now, this skin. Like I said, all the skins are really good, but this one it has to be the worst because of a few reasons. One, Clay overall has better skins. That's the first reason. The second reason is because a lot of people in the community were just irritated that this skin won and not uh, a couple of other skins like the uh, the Time Traveler Colette. That should have won. This skin was, I don't even think, top five in voting. And it's just unfortunate because the uh, creator... Made a good skin, but just the skin on this hate overall was bad. So I have to give this one last, naturally, just because of those reasons. I don't like giving it last, but let's be real. There's definitely better Supercell make skins than this one. Coming in 11th, I went with Zombibi. This is a really cool skin. It's a top three BB skin. The only other better skins, are arguably, are Heroin BB, which is close. And then there's Cursed Pirate BB, which I think is the best BB skin, but... This is a really cool one, however, it is one of the oldest Supercell Max skins. It doesn't have any custom winning or losing animations, which is fine. The, the effects are just really good, but I have to give it 11th just because the newer Supercell Max skins are just way better. Coming in as the 10th best Supercell Max skin, I went with Archvillain B. I own this one and I really like this skin a lot. The, the, however, it falls under the same reason as Zombie B. It's, it is a very older Supercell Max skin. It took a while for Supercell to implement the skin into the game, but they finally did, and it has some of the best effects on a B skin. The only other B skin that's better, Mega Beetle B. But this is still a really cool skin. Uh, like, but just like I said with Zombie B, just it's older, and the newer Supercell Max skins they just have better effects overall. Also, no custom winning or losing animations. Again, that's fine, but still, I just feel like it drops the skin overall just a teeny bit. Coming in as the ninth best Supercell make skin, I went with Nutcracker Gale. This is a really cool one. It has some very nice effects, but again, for the same reasons, it's just a, one of the older skins, and it gets thrown down naturally. That's the problem with ranking these skins. There's a lot of them are just so new, and just the effects overall better. However, the effects on this skin are very cool. However, there is Squeakbuster Gale, which is also a really good skin, so it was hard to rank it because... Obviously, I have to naturally bring it down just because there's other skins, but this is a really cool one So I give it ninth place coming in at the eighth best Supercell make skin whale watch need to know this is a cheaper Cheaper Supercell make skin. It's 79 gems majority. I think are 149. There's a few other 79 gems Including Archville and B and zombie B, but this is probably the one of the better 79 gems Supercell make skin just the effects are very very good and again like, I'm not a big fan of all Anita skins because Anita is like one of my least favorite brawlers, but I can't drag it down just because of that. This skin has some of the better effects in the game. I just think the other skins are overall better than this one, so I give it 8th place for a reason. Coming in as the 7th best Supercell Mega skin, I went with Underworld Bow. Now, Bow has two Supercell Mega skins, so it's kind of hard to rank both of them, but this one has really insane effects. Now, I just wish it had a very cool super effect. It doesn't. Only the Brother Bow skins have that, but it's still... Very cool skin. It's a very demonic skin. That's actually what it was called before they changed it to Underworld. It was called Demonic Bow in the the voting. But this is a very very cool skin. And uh, yeah, from now from this point on, by the way, all these skins are S tier or higher. Like these are just crazy good. 
Coming into the sixth best Supercell make skin, another one that I own, DJ3MZ. This is a very cool M skin. It fits her very well. The effect is really awesome. Her super is my favorite part. Like, look at this. This is awesome. Now, it is one of the older-ish Supercell make skins, so I did drop it down just a bit. And But this is definitely M's best skin, and it has some really insane effects, and I like this skin a lot. That's why I give it six plus. Coming in as the fifth best Supercell skin. I went with Kraken Surge. Now this is one of the newest Supercell Max skins, but it's very, very cool. And it has really cool effects. The super stages are amazing. Everything about the skin is really well made. And the creator is awesome for making this insane skin. Look at these rankums. He becomes a pirate. And yeah, I cannot give the skin <laughs> lower than the bottom pipe. How'd that not hit right there? But this skin, it's amazing. Like, it is one of the best skins in the game, no question. Coming in as the fourth best Supercell Mag skin, I went with Bo's other skin, Horus Bo. Now, this is Bo's best skin. The effects are unbelievable on this skin. Like, he's shooting basically lightning bolts. It's unbelievable. I just wish that I had, like, a custom super blow up. That's the only thing the skin is missing, because Brother Bo has that, and I feel like it actually might be in competition with that skin. But this has always been one of the best skins in the game. The effects are just insanely good, and the looks on this skin are perfect. Like, this is unbelievable. This is a top 5 skin. Well, not top 5, but top 15 in the game. Coming in at the third best Supercell make skin, I went with Kabocha Thing. This skin is unbelievable. Like, the effects are so extremely awesome. It's crazy. It's very cool. The Super actually has some very good detail in it. And this skin overall just fits Fang. It's unbelievable how good this skin is. And uh, yeah, I have to give it the top three. It's a top 10 skin in the game, most likely. It's not the best Supercell Max skin. I think there's just two other better ones because their effects and looks are just better overall. But this is still a very good skin on Fang. Coming in as the second best Supercell Max skin, I went with Dark Angel Cone. A lot of you guys might be flaming me because you probably think I put this one as number one. I don't think this is the best one. I think there's just one better one. But this is easily a top 10 skin in the game, arguably even top 5. The skin has just got some of the best effects in the game that I've ever seen. It's so cool looking. It's crazy. The creator really nailed the job with this cold skin. It's just unbelievably well made. And yeah, I have no other words to describe how clean this skin is. And coming in as the best Supercell Max skin, hot take. I think it's Spirit Knight Frank. This skin's effects are un just amazing. Like, Frank looks so different and it the color scheme just goes so well with him in my opinion i think this is the best supercell mexican i might y'all might disagree here even though frank is just a absolutely terrible brawler but this skin <laughs> at least makes frank <laughs> it makes frank playable because this skin is just so amazing everything about the skin this is a borderline top five skin in the game it could honestly be in the s plus tier i don't think i put it s plus but Honestly, it could be because it's just so good. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video. If you disagree or agree, just comment below. What do you disagree with? Because this was a hard, like I said before, this was such a hard list to make because there's just so many good Supercell Max skins. All of them are so good. So it was really hard to make an accurate tier list of who has the best one. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. <laughs>